Daddy. L.A. ATL, nigga. Oh, uh, uh, hey, I'm back. Up. Yeah, nigga. We What's good, YouTube? Your boy Boss go back again with another video. Hopefully, you're having a great day wherever you are in the universe. This wind, this wind is going. Got my eyes watering. Here at Hollywood and Hollywood once again. You already know what we're here for. Should be so many people here. Not even that many, as you guys can see, right? 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 So we in here now. Let's see what's happening. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe. As you guys can see, the line is not too big at all. Maybe like a couple people. So we definitely should get what we need. Can't lie, it is cold as shit out here. The plane is blowing a little bit. The sun is out, but it's definitely a little cold. Luckily, I brought my jacket. I was going to just come with another sweater, but I'm tired of wearing that same thing. So we had to switch it up a little bit, man. You feel me? Oh. <laughs> we all wait here for the shoes, gotta have some fun, you feel me? <laughs> Back up on it, huh? scram my little megs, I'ma get that bread for I'm gone and dead. Get head like kids up in special ed. Fuck, I just don't rap, I rip tracks and shreds. Oh, these these, passing on these or not. I like this colorway out of the ones I've seen so far. They got this one as well as the white and black colorway, which is not bad. Let me know what you guys think about these in the comment section below. So what do you guys think about this Ultra Boost? I have not seen this colorway. It's like a red, white, and blue theme, Olympics or something like that. That prime knit, that heathered prime knit, if that's the right color. Um, it's pretty dope, man. Let me know what you guys think about this in the comment section below, as always. Your boy gotta get home and make some more videos. So stay tuned for that. Shout out to everybody who came out to the live stream earlier. But let's see what else is in here before we gotta go. 3M on a hip on a toe box. I did not know that. Did you guys know that this shoe has 3M on it? Pretty wild if you ask me. It definitely has like a what the feel. These things are definitely fire. And this is the bad boy that came out today, man. A lot of people out there was asking if I was getting these or not. I've done a few reviews on them. They look pretty dope, bruh. But to be honest with you, in person, I don't know. I mean, I like the black mesh with the red that pokes out under there, if you guys can see that. That red mesh in there, pretty, pretty dope, bro. I like the back panel, that red right there. The cement type of uh, midsole with the dots on it. Then, of course, you know, Kyrie going with the little uh, eyelids on the bottom of the shoe. Very dope, though. I think for me personally, I get it's like a strong, like, seven and a half, maybe eight. I don't know, bro. It is nice, but just not for me. I, th I was thinking a little bit more, especially... Maybe because I'm spoiled. Everything I've been getting from Kyrie so far has been stupid crazy. Like these ones right here. Pretty crazy. Just too much white. That's why I passed on them. But let me know what you guys think about those. And then, of course, I mean, these are like one of my newer favorites. Not the favorite, but one of my newer ones. Like top three for sure. When you get shoes like this so much, and then you get the plain black and red one that I just showed you guys, it really don't add up. But let me know what y'all think, bro. Chilling like a villain. Got what we needed. About to go to the house. Uh, edit these videos. I got to get home because we got company coming by today. Stay tuned for those videos, man, as well. It's your boy, Bosco, man. I appreciate all the support. I'm about to get out here so I can get back to the car and dig. What's good, YouTube? Your boy, Bosco, back again with another sneaker video. Hopefully, you're having a great day wherever you are in the universe. As you can see in front of me, we're talking about some more Nikes, man. These shoes are pretty fire. By the title, you already know what we're here talking about. The Nike Zoom Rookie 2019 release was pretty hyped, pretty limited. A lot of people was going for them where I went to. Uh, a lot of places didn't get them where I thought they would get them. If you were able to get a pair, let me know. If not, go ahead and check out Golder Stock X. You might be able to find them for not too much over retail, you feel me? Without further ado, man, we're going to get into this box. I just want to give a shout out to everybody who comes out to the live streams. We do it pretty often, almost daily. Uh, great conversation. I like chilling out with you guys. So that's why you also need to have your notifications on and be updated on every single thing your boy Bosco drops because I definitely drop every single day. Maybe a live stream and a video, some time a double upload. So hit the notification bell just to be updated. Without further ado, let's get into this box, you dig? All right, now as you see, a typical box, typical Nike box, nothing special about this thing right here. This is obviously Nike Zoom Rookie Premium. Uh, retail 220 size 13 black black action red man this shoe right here you already know what it is bro without further ado let's go ahead and pull this thing out but these shoes are far from simple and regular bro let me know your thoughts and opinions in the comment section below the nike zoom rookie 2019 
galaxy, bro. These things are crazy fire. Cop pass, fire or trash. How many of you guys went after these things but was not able? I know a lot of people out there like these shoes. There are a few people who didn't like them or suck on them or didn't think they were as hot as they were. But you know, everybody's entitled to their opinion. That's the beautiful thing about this world. And this shoe right here is Muy Fuego. Uh, let me know your thoughts, man. I really want to know who thinks this is a 10, who thinks this is straight trash. I mean, because we all have different opinions, so you know there's going to be people from all walks of life. But this one is very dope. A lot of differences, uh, well, a few differences from this one compared to the 2012, which I also do own. Um, this one just has much more of a shinier finish, bro. And then the outsoles are just more, you know, like uh, these glow in the dark, first of all. The last ones do not glow in the dark. Look at that out outsole, bro. That is crazy. And of course, we're going to get the up close and personal visuals on the shoe like I always do. And even the on feet. These things right here are crazy, bro. I, I don't even know what to say besides fire. I love the glossy finish on them. The black, they switched the Nike check from the 2012s. It's now a white Nike check with black stitching. On the 2012s, they were, uh, it was a black Nike check with white stitching. Little details, differences there. And then a lot of people said on the outsole, they, they mentioned this right here. The one cent logo is not on the outsole like it normally would be in this part of the shoe. But it's going to dark, so I mean, I'll take the... I'll take the glow in the dark over the one cent. I think, yeah. What would you? Would you rather have the one cent logo here or have a glow in the dark sole? Everybody's different. I want to see the different opinions. The black laces are perfect with this shoe. Nothing needs to be changed about this thing. Nothing. This is a 10 out of 10 to me. Creme de la creme. Uh, one of them shoes that, um, you know, this shoe for me is like how people see some George that people feel you know are are really coveted or must have this galaxy foam or galaxy nike zoom rookie as well as the foam pilot galaxy not necessarily the big bangs i'm more of a fan of the galaxy as opposed to the big bangs and um just fire bro i would love to know your feedback you guys like galaxy more big bangs or you guys got a foam pilot theme at all person you know what i'm saying i love to know the feedback uh, we're gonna get to the up close and personal highlights of these bad boys it's a pleasure to see these things come back since 2012 uh much much different bro actually uh, let me just show really quick i did do a live stream kind of talking about this but in this video i'll also do it just to show you guys a brief look at the differences between them i mean you can kind of tell already by the coloring you can see the definite finish on the right one which is the 2019 compared to the uh 2012 uh, like I said, the Nike checks on the, the toe area is different. And then the uh, main thing is the outsoles and then the finish. This one has more of a matte finish. This one here has definitely more of a glossy finish, as you can see. Both of these have uh, these uh, Nike patches can come off. It has the one cent logo behind it. Everything else is pretty much the same except for three major things. The glossy finish, the outsole, and then the Nike check on the toe box. But uh, let me know what you guys think about these shoes in the comment section, Cop Pass, Fire, or Crash. It's been great talking to you guys once again. Without further ado, highlights and on feed. Peace.
I want to take this time and thank you for watching. Hopefully you like, comment, subscribe, and uh, tell a friend and tell a friend. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you share it with everybody else you know too. And I'm about to get out of here, man. Take care of a few more things. Have a great day wherever you are in the universe. Deuces.